Hi, it's Matt and welcome to Collaboration Coach. This time I've got three tips to make it easier to tackle your email using Copilot. I'm gonna use Copilot to summarize a long message so I can quickly understand it. Then it's gonna draft a reply for me to speed up my writing time. And finally, it's gonna coach me on how to improve my writing. I'll do all that in no time at all using Copilot for Microsoft 365. So let's take a look and see how it works. My first tip is to use Copilot to summarize a message. For this demo, I'm using the new Outlook on Windows, but this will work the same with old Outlook. I've received a long email from Megan that I don't have time to read right now, and I want Copilot to summarize it for me. So all I need to do is choose Summary by Copilot, and the summary is added to the message above here and it's condensed all that text into five easy to read lines. Megan's telling me that account management is important and why, and that there's a meeting I need to be at at 3 p.m. on Thursday. So lucky I didn't miss that detail. Next tip, drafting. Copilot can draft my reply to Megan for me. I'll choose reply, and then I'll go to the Copilot button on the ribbon, and I'll choose draft with Copilot. It asks me what I want to say. I want to briefly acknowledge the points in the message and confirm that I can attend that meeting. Then I hit generate. Now Copilot has a think and when it comes back, it's got a nicely structured reply. It's basically agreeing with what Megan said and letting her know that I'll be at the meeting. The reply is good, but the tone is a little off. Usually I wouldn't be so formal. So down here, I can choose to change it. I could type it here, but there's already a list of options in this dropdown, and I'll choose to make it sound more casual. Now this version sounds more like the tone I was after, and the previous version is still available, so I could go back a page if I wanted to, and I could regenerate to get more versions as well, but I'm happy with this one, so I'm gonna choose keep it. It adds the text to the body of the message, and now I can go in and format and edit it to make it my own. Okay, next tip, writing coach. Copilot can suggest how I can improve my writing. To start the coaching, I go to the ribbon and choose coaching by Copilot. This panel opens up and I have three sections here, tone, reader sentiment, and clarity. So let's start with tone. Tone is looking at how my responses could match Megan's enthusiasm. I started my email with, thanks for your email, I'm totally with you. And Copilot is suggesting that I say, I completely agree with you. To make me sound more confident and to make Megan sure that I see things the way she does. I prefer that turn of phrase, so I'm gonna swap those two out. And I have to manually cut and paste to swap those phrases. Now next is reader sentiment or ways to involve the reader in what I'm saying. I said I'm looking forward to chatting more and Copilot is suggesting I'm looking forward to hearing insights and suggestions. And I like that because it's direct and it shows that I'm interested in what she thinks. So I'll swap those. I'm also gonna end with a call to action and that's let me know if you have questions or concerns. And then finally, under clarity, Copilot thinks I should add more detail. And if I refer to retaining and growing our customer base, instead of saying just how important account management is, that sounds better. I'm happy with that draft now. I'm going to clean up the formatting and then send the reply. Okay, so there you have three tips to make it easier to read and reply to emails using Copilot for Microsoft 365 in Outlook. I use Copilot to summarize a message for me. Then it helped me draft a reply in different styles. And then it coached me on how to make my writing better. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.